this is Mrs. Cooper with the weekly update for the week of May 27th, 2021. Here are some upcoming events. Drama Club will have a fundraising car wash at the elementary school, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. on Saturday, May 29th. This Monday, May 31st, school is closed for Memorial Day. June 7th to 11th is Spirit Week at the elementary school. Details on what to wear each day will be in next week's video. The fifth grade moving up ceremonies will be held on Monday, June 14th at 8.30 a.m. for Ms. Lubin and Ms. Sonborn's class. 1.15 on June 14th is for Ms. Kiger and Ms. Spiegel's classes. Tuesday, June 15th, Ms. Colavito and Mr. Thornton will be at 8.30 a.m. Kindergarten graduation will be Wednesday, June 16th for Ms. Kennedy and Ms. Jordan at 8.30 a.m. Also on June 16th at 1.15 is Ms. Owens and Ms. Crame's class. Fifth grade moving up and kindergarten graduations will be virtual, live streamed events through Facebook Live. Thursday, June 10th is senior graduation at 6 p.m. at Santa Lucia's High School. Thursday, June 17th is middle school graduation, also at 6 p.m., also at Santa Lucia's High School. The last day of school will be Friday, June 18th. State standardized testing is almost done, only high school testing remains. Graduating seniors should come to campus on June 7th to pick up caps and gowns. Please remember to bring your Chromebook and any other PBMA books and fees when you pick up your cap and gown. This includes a $75 Herf Jones rental fee for the cap and gown if you didn't pre-order through. It will also be live streamed for friends and family that can't attend. Here's a message from Miss Smith. Hi PBMA families, it's Mrs. Smith, the principal at the elementary campus. I just wanted to give a huge congratulations to all of our third, fourth, and fifth grade students on completing their FSA. And I am so excited to announce that we had 100% participation. So thank you parents, thank you students, thank you all staff for making that possible. In regards to receiving scores, um, third grade reading will be released on June 30th, and the rest of the scores are scheduled to be released on July 31st. Once we receive the scores and they're mailed to us, we will be mailing them out to parents or give you the option to come and pick them up at campus. Thank you. Ms. Trish created lightning in the classroom. Let's take a look. All right, so to create our cloud, we are only gonna need a few things. We're gonna need a two liter bottle. We're gonna need some isopropyl alcohol. We're gonna need a bicycle pump. And we are going to need a valve stem to keep our air in. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pressurize this container and we are going to evaporate alcohol just like we would be evaporating water in the air. And so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pump this up and add a whole bunch of pressure real fast. And then I'm gonna take the top off and we are going to see a cloud form instantly. So let's add some pressure very quickly and as soon as we have enough pressure get ready for the sound <laughs> and if you do this at home you do not breathe this vapor this is alcohol this is not evaporated water like in the clouds in a real cloud in the sky that's evaporated alcohol and if we add some pressure again just like in the sky if we have high pressure we will dissipate the clouds and the clouds will disappear so when we add pressure uh, it pushes the clouds out of the sky so all right one more time just for fun <laughs> get ready get set there we go. <laughs> and there's a cloud in the bottle. Kind of cool, huh? Okay, so we're gonna stay seated again. This is a Tesla coil named for Nikola Tesla, the scientist whose vision was to give everyone free electricity. And he wanted everyone to be able to have electricity. 
So I'm going to turn this on. It's going to make a bit of a popping noise. And I'm going to turn up the volume on our lightning for just a moment. And then we are going to turn the lights off. And turn up the amperage. And we have lightning. And just like Nikola Tesla, we can use that lightning to light our lights. So there <laughs> So there's a lot of power, a lot of power in that lightning that we can harness, that we can use. And as we said, if you touch a doorknob and get shocked, this is what's happening. <laughs> Here's a message from Miss Murphy. Hello, PBMA students and families. We are so excited about our class of 2021 graduation for our seniors on June 10th. Please note that we have been able to get your requests and have heard you and keeping social distancing and all of the protocols we need, we will be able to give three additional tickets per student for graduation. We hope that you will all come out and support our kids. We're so grateful to have you there and we're also looking forward to a wonderful event. Also remember on June 17th is our eighth grade graduation. The tickets are limited to two due to the size of the class. We really appreciate your coming out again and supporting our students. Also, it will be live streamed on Facebook. Thank you so much for everything. We've had a wonderful year, even with all of the challenges that we've had. Our students have been amazing stepping up and proceeding to do incredible things. Hi, juniors and seniors. If you are interested in a community service opportunity, please see your Jupiter Ed message regarding the Flags for Fallen Heroes event this Sunday, May 30, 30th, um, uh, at the National Cemetery located on Lake Worth Road. Thank you. And finally, here are the secondary shocks of the week. Please remember to like and follow us on Facebook to stay informed of important information. I'm Mrs. Cooper and this is Bailey. Thanks for watching and remember an engaged parent is a great parent.